good afternoon, appreciate doctors. This opportunity, uh, very honored and grateful to the International Institute of Crime and Security Science uh, and the Dr. K. Hashinkar, founding principal director. Uh, then we talk uh, first about the cybercrime and digital natives. Uh, in this sense, uh, we have the, the cyberspace has become a privileged environment for the mass dissemination of content, uh, significantly amplifying of damage uh, of such offense to a global sphere. These are so called content cyber, uh, cyber crime and cyber attacks, uh, the first type of the cyber attacks, economic uh, cyber crimes poses troubles in incriminate the alleged criminals and conclude uh, a successful criminal prosecution. Uh, the second category, social civil crimes, uh, also presents characteristics of rapid evolution uh, and it's not exempt from difficulties in applying uh, existing criminal per sets. Uh, and the third category, political uh, civil crimes, um, presents obstacles in privation with risks uh, of affecting free, freely exercised fundamental rights and naturally in the attribution of criminal liability to the perpetration. Uh, social civil crimes are based on the translation to the internet of social relation existence in real life. In particular, they are reflected uh, in the already typified crimes arising for relationships and conflicts between the people. The coronavirus pandemic with his hit Western countries hard in March 2020, making on market uh, a thorny point in uh, the use uh, of ICTs to avoid face-to-face -face meetings. Whatever from a work perspective, teleworking, uh, or from a friendship and affective perspective, uh, increasing the incidence of social civil crimes, millennials uh, or digital natives who are electronics devices for a large part of their daily activities are the generation with uh, the highest exposure uh, to suffer the repercussions of this category of civil crime. Uh, as well, uh, when no people can be harassed through digital means, civil space offers the possibility of carrying out thousands of kilometers away uh, insults, slander, thirds, coercion, and other aggressions uh, at minimal cost easily, properly through social networks. Civil crime with the future or the figure of the hacker. Uh, uh, if, if we focus on age uh, as a factor in the profile to the cyber criminal, it's real that most civil crimes are committed by young people. There are basically two reasons for this phenomenon. Uh, the fact uh, that young people can be considered digital natives and that they have more time available to look for vulnerabilities in networks. This uh, leads us to conclude uh, that uh, as the years go by, the, these digital knives get older. The average age of the virtual offender will also increase. Uh, then we talk uh, the most significant profiles of civil criminals. The first of theirs of this describes uh, as disloyal or resentful uh, worker who upon leaving the company and the with and vindicate proposed attacks 
its data storage system and with a Pindivid uh, proposed attacks uh, is the talking advantage uh, of, of his access uh, and the knowledge he has acquired on the job using his access and knowledge acquired on the job. Uh, in Anglo-Saxon doctrine, uh, his, uh, this profile, profile is known as insider. Uh, in these cases, we call be taking about the crime of computer damage of cracking. The second profile corresponds to the criminal with developed computer skills who in some way boycotts to the computer tools of an in outside entity and after achieved it offers anonymous, anonymously of a color tree to restore the stage of things uh, after the violation created by him. The subject would, uh, on this occasion, uh, be quality of the crime or computer damage, such as uh, those described uh, in this uh, previous paragraph, for example. A uh, professionalist group that it's guided by this behavior, kindness, are very criers uh, who enter a computer system in order to introduce a virus into it with uh, the aim of destroying uh, the system, with uh, the aim of the this information uh, as is possible to uh, differentiate between uh, begin virus uh, which anonymous but to do no harm and malicious virus similarly these profiles corresponds to several uh, scammers who may engage uh, its phishing farming fake cells or fake actions uh, it's also uh, common, thirdly, the criminal vocation in a primary occasional uh, and solitary offender who, who uh, with uh, little computer uh, knowledge by but talking about of the possibilities um, and the form of tools but taking advance uh, of the accessing training use the internet to middle in the intimate secrets uh, that both uh, his close notes ex-partners uh, co-workers works competitor uh, fellow students for example and people with a certain public projection uh, may have in order to bring them to light by telematic means accessible uh, to the general public, incurring on course in criminal uh, of discovery and disclosure of secrets. Uh, on the other hand, the youngest uh, can also can uh, play the role to active subject in certainly criminal behaviors uh, in a virtual world uh, where they have developed their skills naturally since childhood. Uh, from childhood, in a natural way, those cases of cyberbullying or moving or, or stalking are common not ways due to the easy uh, of instant, instantaneous capture of imaging uh, and some they have things or their cell phones and the habitual is uh, the makeup of the, this age of virtual communication uh, tools such as uh, a chat, social networks, emails, or even of video game chats, uh, in, 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 in others. Example: the, the normalization uh, the, of these behaviors among their peers and the minimization of the risks associated with these behaviors only encourage new forms of uh, crime uh, as information exchange system emerge uh, 
of the internet. Likewise, uh, the case of child grooming is also where now, uh, in which middle age uh, in, of older or elderly individuals, generally males, uh, simulate their age thanks to the possibilities of anonymity uh, and identify simulation that the network allows. In other, the approach minors with sexual intention who are vulnerable uh, to this, this type in threat of the network. However, the, the difference uh, of criminal decisions in cyberspace, cyberspace is an use that has between middle with the Adrenalis Pike Doctrine in uh, um, which states uh, and private entities have focused on recent changes. In fact, not only have legislative advances and reforms being implemented, but uh, also the prevention of the civil crime has been sold from a technical or a state security perspective with a focus on both victims and perpetrators, uh, advance and reforms that today seem to be lagging behind in effecting in a phase of the unstoppable rise in civil crime. But the fight against civil crime involves much more. Uh, above all, civil criminals are demonstrating a wide and superior knowledge of civil crime to carry uh, out their criminal action compared to their victims. Therefore, it's required, especially, a high-level training uh, for the actors involved in the civil crime trouble, uh, uh, then raising awareness of civil security uh, and fundamental rights issues among the personnel and church then uh, incentivize for the specialists to participate and provide timely and effective advice. Finally, the active participation of the state sector and public and private companies. Thank you very much for your attention.